there and welcome back. In this video, we are going to talk about systematic audience targeting and how really to find that fish pot that brings you sales. My name is Sylvia Myers and over the past six years, I've empowered thousands of online stores in over 35 countries around the world with knowledge designed to quadruple return on edge spend. So what I want to show you guys now is how do we apply this process inside our Facebook ads managers. And so in this one, I started kind of from the higher chunk, right? I was like, okay, so I'm selling canvas and this is the higher chunk. This is home decor product. And the size uh, worldwide is quite large. I can see here 88 million. And so I personally am targeting US. So I've chosen US in here and left the edge uh, quite broad because I decided that my avatar could be, uh, could be in any of these brackets so far. As always, I've got the detail targeting expansion off. I've got home decor products and I also decided to include engaged shoppers. So it must also match engaged shoppers, which means that I'm also looking for people who are more likely to be clicking. These two combinations together, we're looking at 8.6 million people. All right. Now, anything over 1 million is fine. 8.6 million, that's completely fine. It is slightly on the broader side as Facebook is showing us, but that's uh, completely uh, fine because we are just starting this testing and looking at the for the right audience. And as your pixel is learning over time, this gauge will go further inside the middle. So let me uh, target uh, three more audiences uh, inside this campaign. So in this case, all we do is just uh, hit the duplicate button and I'm going to duplicate it three times because I know I want to create three more ad sets. And now let me look at the suggestions. So these suggestions typically show me a different level of chunking. Okay. So these suggestions typically show you what else is there, but actually, you know what? I know that I'm selling canvas prints. And I do want to find the right level of chunking. So here we go. There is canvas print interest. So this is relatively specific, but let's see how many we're going to get. So I'm going to extra home decor products. I'm going to leave canvas print. And this is actually still a nice size audience. It's 1.8 million. That's actually quite, quite nice. So now I've got two audiences set up. So straight away, I just moved to the third one. So the third one, remember, we also in some of the questions were questions about like brands, you know, what brands do you use? Is there any, um, you know, any magazines or anything like that? So I decided that actually if I'm selling uh, brands, again, detail targeting expansion, we turn off. I've decided that, you know what? Lots of home products um, are actually sold in Ikea. So, and Ikea sells similar products to the product I am selling. It's kind of, um, you know, well-priced, but, uh, it's relatively good quality and it's kind of really, uh, on trend modern. So that's going to be good audience for me to target. So I'm going to X the home decor product. I'm going to remove that and I'm going to keep Ikea and engage shoppers add million beautiful. And then last one that would be left for me would be looking at, uh, is there a magazine, for example? So I know there is like L decor, for example, L decor magazine. Awesome. So this one would be 3.9. So that's kind of quite good as well. Awesome. And so essentially just like that, I've got my system set up with literally four audiences, right? All right, guys. So that's uh, essentially how you set up in Facebook.